bath? Is it how does it feel to take an ice bath? Like, what are the benefits of taking an ice bath? Why do I do it in the first place? And I'll run it all down in today's video. Starting off with number one, as you all know, taking ice baths daily after a workout it reduces muscle soreness by it just reduces the swelling and it gets rid of the lactic acid. So taking them after a workout is a great way to reduce muscle soreness. But there is one drawback and that is you will, your muscles will not grow as much. Yes, it is has been known that taking ice baths blocks hypertrophy, which is the growth of your muscles. Your muscles growing, yeah. Taking ice baths reduces your muscle growth. So be wary of that. You can either take an ice bath 20 minutes before working out or wait around eight hours after working out to not to prevent it from blocking high muscle hypertrophy number two taking ice baths it releases endorphins into your body which is a natural painkiller and enhances your mood it releases dopamine taking ice baths shown to increase your dopamine level by up to 250 percent which is very similar to what somebody would get from cocaine and this is, it's not like a swift drop it's not like it's a sustained thing so taking ice baths if you want that extra dopamine hit to feel better be happier and be more motivated start taking ice baths it will increase your dopamine levels it reduces anxiety and depression pretty standard getting into an ice bath you've panicked all you're getting that a ton of adrenaline your your body's producing a ton of adrenaline when you step into that ice bath it should be pretty obvious why it's going to reduce depression anxiety and all that bad stuff you don't okay number five on the list increases the production of brown fat and brown fat is not like your normal fat the stuff you see not fat fat brown fat is like deep in your body and it's like it keeps your body warm you know if you see people who are like adapted to the cold or something maybe they have more brown fat their genetics allow that but brown fat it uh your body becomes more adapted to the cold you're not gonna be sh freezing your ass off like how everybody normally is during come winter you're gonna be more cold adapted. You will not freeze. Uh, brown fat, I believe, like kicks in right before you start shivering. It's gonna keep you warmer. Taking ice baths will increase your immunity. You will not get sick as often when you take ice baths. It is said to increase your metabolic rate. I'm assuming that means your body gets like hotter or something, it burns more calories. All I know is that it will increase your immunity. You will not get as sick as much. You will not get colds from taking ice baths. You get nicer skin. Taking ice baths is, you're going into cold water. It's gonna reduce inflammation in your skin. It's gonna give your skin that nice glowing look like how everyone's looking for. It's going to make it a whole lot smoother and a whole lot nicer. If you want nice looking skin, take ice baths. Taking ice baths increases your discipline. We all know that it takes a ton of work to start getting into an ice bath. You have to go through the, all that mental effort negotiating with yourself to get yourself to take an ice bath. It is not fun taking an ice bath. The first like 30 seconds of an ice bath is like the worst part. You, shock, you get like that shock stepping in. It takes a lot of mental effort to will yourself to get into an ice bath when you're first starting out. It does seem to get a little bit easier as you progress and as you're doing it more often, but it will increase discipline and mental toughness and resilience. And this one's kind of a little bonus. Taking ice baths, when you do them in the morning, they wake you up. Yeah, you are you kind of get a shock, you get that adrenaline spike, and it's gonna wake you up. It's basically like taking coffee, or release some chemicals in your brain, like I said, adrenaline. It's gonna wake you the hell up. Start your day off productively, you may want to consider putting an ice bath into your morning routine. And with that, that will be the end of today's video. Start giving ice baths a try and tell me if you like it. You don't have to do it every day like me. Maybe just try one. I don't know, fill up your bathtub with cold water or something. Try it out. Um, like, subscribe, comment. I'll be see you guys in the next video.